My mum was a clown. She was, you know, catering for kids' parties. There's not many people that get away with calling their mum a clown. Oh, no. Well, you know what? I get used to get teased for it too. She decided she wanted to open up a party shop. And at the time, I think I was three or four years old. And as a family business, you get, you get pushed into working in the family business. So, you know, they had me there sitting on a little kid's chair, putting sand in bags, which would become the, the weight for balloons, essentially, to hold them down on the table. And I got paid five cents each time I made one. Awesome. Uh, so very much slave labor, but it taught me a lot. And I, I really actually appreciate it now. I saw on your LinkedIn recently that you've now got your kids working in the party people. It's come full circle. It has another first job I got her to do was the sandbags. <laughs> she was pretty good. I mean, she was five when she first started. Now she's six, but like yeah, we the, yeah, like, yeah, that's it. <laughs> we got her working in the business. It was just so great. I mean, I, again, I could talk about this a fair bit. It's something I'm actually a little bit more passionate about after doing it with my kid and then thinking about what I learned from the experience of working in the family business and what values and work ethic it gave me. And then seeing what that means for, for her and, and thinking, well, this is actually pretty good. I want to do more of this for her because I wanted to gain this experience. I wanted to get the work ethic. I want this to be normal for her. And I wanted to be well-adjusted later in life. I mean, I paid her 20 bucks as well, but I That's certainly didn't get good. 